Okay. Uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and good uh, morning. Good morning, Prof. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, sorry. Uh, I will share the slide in the PDF and then I make sure that uh, it doesn't have. Uh, yeah, it is uh, black and white in color. Okay. Because. Uh, I need to do some touch up on 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 uh, improve the slide content, uh, so it's better for me to to uh, to redo it again, okay, and then uh, put in the e-learning, okay, okay. So uh, for today, for this morning, okay, we we may discuss on the finance law, okay. So I will try to cover uh, for two cases which is the linear failure plane, okay? And also on the total stress uh, methods, okay? Because I, I, I guess I could not cover up to uh, method of slices, okay? Might be for the next class, okay, I will cover on the method of slices, okay? <clears throat> So to begin with, uh, we may look on this example, okay? Uh, on this, uh, derivation of uh, the uh, finite slope with linear failure plane. Okay. Um, so, uh, um, okay, this is the equation that's been derived, okay, where we assume that the failure uh, occur, okay, uh, okay, where the failure is occur uh, in this uh, region, okay, so this is due to, for example, to the uh, to the uh, compaction effort. Okay, uh, when construct the the embankment, okay, uh, or we uh, have identified that uh, there is a weak uh, layer, okay, which is uh, show in a linear mode. Okay, so in that case, okay, we may identify what is the uh, volume of this um, block, okay, to obtain the value of W, okay. So the RS is the resisting force, okay, that prevent from the slope to slide, okay, while uh, the T is the driving force, okay, which allow to this block to move downward, okay. <clears throat> So uh, the potential uh, slope failure, okay, is referred to the theta, okay, while the, the slope degree is referred to beta, okay. So the equation is CL, okay, uh, which is uh, the length of this uh, point from point A to point C, okay, times with the coefficients of the material, okay. And at the same time, uh, the the what we call as the the normal stress okay, acting on perpendicular to the failure plane, okay, uh, times with the tangent phi. Okay. So that is for the resisting uh, force. Okay. Why for the driving force? Okay. So we need to determine what is the whole uh, width of the block. We also need to use it. We, we, we also use it for the n value. Okay. So for the w, so sign with the theta. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So from the figure line AC is the trial failure plane. The weight of the soil ABC is okay. This is the formula that we can use. Okay. So actually, we need to understand how to determine the 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 volume of this area. It is not a typical equation for a triangle uh, uh, area. So in that case, uh, half times l a times gamma times l times h is sine beta minus theta over sine beta. Okay. So that is the that is the equation for uh, uh, for the volume for the uh, for sorry width for the ABC soil. Okay. 
So the force that will cause the failure is T equal to W sine theta, okay? And the resistance, resistance to sliding is given by RS, okay, which is CD times L plus W cos theta tangent pi B. Okay. Then the further safety will be RS over W sine theta or equal then CL plus W cos theta tangent P over W sine theta. Okay, so that is the formula for the factor safety for this uh, failure plane. <clears throat> so later on, we may introduce several, uh, what we call as uh, several uh, equations. Okay, for example, critical condition prevent that when W A T is equal to R, okay, by substituting F S equal to one, then we obtain C D is equal to uh, half gamma H okay, times sine beta okay, as, as, as shown in this uh, equation. Okay, so um, <clears throat> okay for critical failure plane, <clears throat> the 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 theta okay uh, that should be used okay uh, is equal to beta plus phi d over two okay so you can find out this uh, explanation in the das uh, reference book okay or in prof dr nuli uh, reference book okay so they discuss or they show in terms of how they obtain the theta which is equal to beta plus uh, phi d over two, okay? So this is, uh, they call, uh, to get the maximum uh, value of theta, which is under the failure, the critical failure plane, okay? Then substituting uh, theta. Sorry, doctor, uh, can I ask yes. a question? The phi is the internal friction angle of the soil, right? Yes, yes. Uh. The phi is the internal the, the, the theta is the sorry the theta is the degree of of the uh, failure plane so while the beta is the degree of the slope uh, and okay and uh, substituting theta then we get okay this um value okay and solving for H and replacing C by C D by C, then we obtain uh, uh, this uh, this equation. Okay, so actually the C D okay, uh, F V as we have discussed previously, okay, which is the F F S sorry F F D okay, F C sorry F C is equal to uh, C uh, C over C D. Okay. And also for the F phi is equal to phi over phi d. Okay. So we may use it later on okay, in, in, in solving uh, several examples. Okay. <clears throat> so where hi is the steep depth of the cut and beta is the slope angle. Okay. So we can use this equation okay, to, to determine uh, uh, what is the, the 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 height of the vertical cut? Okay, so by using the F C equal to C over C D. Okay, so later on we can determine uh, we can include the factor safety in the calculation. Okay, uh, for example, if the factor safety is equal to two, then we can uh, use the equation of F. C equal to C over C D. Okay, I will show in 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 in, uh, in some of example later on. Okay, to determine what is the safe depth based on uh, factor safety uh, that has been provided. For example, if we want to choose or we want to use factor safety is equal to two. Okay, then we can uh, we can uh, calculate what is the height. So and another example, uh, the FSC or FSV, okay, could be used, okay, as a try and error methods, okay. 
So for example, we need to make sure that the FSC is equal to FSV okay, from the calculation. Okay, uh, if uh, the first attempt okay, doesn't show uh, a similar or same result, so we need to uh, do uh, at least three prior tests okay, and then we need to plot for a graph. Okay, I will show it later. Okay. <coughs> <clears throat> so same principle value for condition where a slope consists of two layers where the upper layer is assumed to slide along the interface between two layers. Okay? So this is condition where they have two type of material. Okay? So, uh, <clears throat> so to, 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 to determine the factor safety, okay, we may choose uh, for, for, the, uh, for the top of the slope. Okay? Uh, to get the factor safety value, the pot, uh, yeah, to determine the potential uh, failure slip, is uh, failure, uh, uh, failure, uh, plane fail, uh, failure plane, okay, of of the of this loop. Okay. Okay. Uh, I, I will refer to uh, several example from Dr. Noli and also from Dust. And also, I will include uh, one example from Dr. Kamarudin, okay, which is I not share in the e-learning yet. Okay. So I will share uh, up, right after the class. Eh? Okay. So we go for example uh, for this linear failure plane. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So this is explanation in Dr. Noli Goffa uh, reference book. Okay. So for assumption of linear failure plane, the soil mass is divided into the upper soil mass that we slide on the surface of the lower mass. The plane of the weakness is assumed to pass through the toe of the field as shown in figure for 5.2. In this figure, line AC is the trial failure plane. Okay, so this, this is what we have discussed previously. Okay. So this is all the equation. Okay. Uh, for example, a half gamma LH. So how they derive gamma is equal to the unit width of the soil mass L equal to H over sine theta. So then later on, uh, they, uh, they determine the H, okay, small letter of H. So to get the, to get the, the, the volume for the uh, WF for the AC area, ABC area. Okay. So something 5.2. Uh, 5.13 and 5.12 a b and then get the result for the 5.13 okay, so this is the force 5.14 5 5.15 okay. so this is the c the cd okay where we use the fsc equal to c over cd okay. uh, and tangent phi is the developed friction okay where we use the tangent phi over 
tangent 5D for the FS. Okay, the safety, the, the, the factor safety will be, okay, so this is the, 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 the one that we have derived previously. Okay. So critical condition prevent that, okay. Um, so the, for, for the critical angle for theta can be determined by creating the first derivation of CD in equation this one. So we respect to zero, we respect to theta to zero, okay. Then uh, for solving for theta, the result is, okay, so we, uh, 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 for example, this will, will become zero and then uh, we try to solve uh, the equation, okay. So they they want to get the maximum uh yeah the critical okay then they want to get the maximum condition so at the end the theta is equal to beta plus phi d over two okay uh, then include the theta uh, to represent the critical height of the uh, of the uh, to get the critical condition okay and then uh, rearrange to get the critical height okay uh, for uh, for the slope okay so i either we can use uh, this is equation is for the critical height okay or we can use uh, this uh, uh, what we call uh, uh, equation okay to determine uh, the height for for certain uh, for for any uh, factor safety, okay. So where h is the self, which is the safe depth of cut, okay. So uh, to get the value for for the factor safety, eh, to get the value for the height, okay. <clears throat> uh, we need to make sure that uh, the FSC is equal to FSC, okay. Later on, I will show uh, the example, okay. Okay, so this is another uh, uh, condition, okay, where they have two layer of soil. So the same approach that we can use, okay, by determining the stability for, uh, for the soil at the top. Okay, I guess it's very difficult if we want to determine the stability for both soil, okay, due to the soil have a different uh, pro soil properties okay? so in that case we only consider the soil uh, at the top okay so this uh, for the first example okay uh, a slope as in figure uh, 5 5.2 5, 5 is cut through to societa okay the height of the slope is 5 meter and the height of the upper stratum is 3 meter. And the lower stratum is highly permeable cohesive soil. Okay. The angle of the slope is beta is equal to 45 and the angle of the SU failure plane is beta is equal to 30. 30. Okay. The shear strength parameter at the interface of the two soil is uh, 7 kPa and uh, 525. So the unit weight of the upper layer is 16.5. Determine the factor safety against sliding. Okay. <clears throat> so uh, first of all, uh, we, we need to determine the W value. Okay. So for the W value, uh, the distance between L or the length between uh, this point to C okay, is equal to uh, D over sine theta. Okay, where the D is the three meter sine theta, uh, and then we get six meter. Okay. So then, um, uh, to get the uh, the H, actually this H, this H. Okay. So D over sine theta times sine theta minus theta. Okay. So put all the in Put put uh, the include all the input, so then we get one point one. Okay. So later on the equation is half gamma L H. Okay. Uh, then we get fifty four point four. Okay. So that is for the W. <clears throat> uh, 
I will explain later on by using Dr. Kamaruddin equation, okay? Uh, Dr. Kamaruddin example, okay? Uh, to determine exact, uh, yeah, to, to show how to, to, to determine the, uh, the, what we call as the word, the, the, the which of this, uh, block, a uh, which of this soil, or the block of this soil. Okay. So then the driving force is equal to 27.2, okay. Um, while the resisting force based on the equation, okay, uh, is equal to 64, okay. So factor safety, uh, 64 over 27.2. So that is the value for the uh, stability of this slope, 2.35, okay. So this is... Uh, uh, a straightforward calculation okay, where we uh, determine the factor safety okay, by using the RS over T formula. Okay. <clears throat> so in problem 5.3, okay, so a vertical cut is to be made through a soil mass. Okay. The soil has the following properties, okay, uh, gamma, C, and T. Okay, evaluate the, the safe depth of the cut using a factor safety of two. Okay, so for this case, uh, uh, the, the author has already provided the factor safety value. Okay, so different with this one. Okay, so this one we need to determine the factor safety. Okay, so uh, therefore to determine the factor safety uh, for this, uh, for the case of number uh, 5.3, okay. So we may use uh, the formula of the FSC and also the FFT. Okay. <clears throat> so by using the beta is equal to 90. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, okay, this is for a vertical cut, eh? different. This is vertical cut, while this is for uh, 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 what we call as a slope with a certain uh, beta L, beta value okay. so because this is beta is equal to 45 okay while for, while for this case uh, for a vertical cut okay so the beta is equal to 90 okay <clears throat> so for factor safety is, is equal to 2 okay then c by using the fsc okay uh, 25 is the c value Okay. Why two two is the what we call it, two is the uh, factor safety value. Okay. So then twenty five divided with two, it is equal to twelve point five. Okay. While for the fee, okay, by using the uh, FS fee, okay, so. Okay, by using this one, okay, FS. Uh, as FS fee, okay, which is equal to tangent fee over tangent phi d, okay. So our factor safety is, is, is equal to two, okay. Then the tangent twenty one, because the fee is twenty one, so we obtain eleven, okay. So then include uh, the value for the c and also for the fee in the equation of the HCR, then we obtain the height for this vertical cut under factor safety of 2 is equal to 2.6 okay okay <clears throat> so then for example 5.4 okay. so a 2 meter vertical cut is required for construction of trench, okay. So the unit width of the soil is 19.0, while its strength parameter C 20.2 and V 28, okay. So calculate the factor safety of the cut with respect to the both C and V, okay. So for this case, uh, we need to determine the factor safety, okay. While, while for the first previous case, uh, the, the second previous case, we need to determine the height. 
after we know what is the factor safety required. Okay. Uh, calculate the factor safety of the card with respect to C, uh, to the both C and T parameter. Okay. <clears throat> so we use this equation and we already know that the height is equal to 2 meter. Okay. So then, okay, uh, the process is uh, we may uh, use a try and error methods. Okay, for example, uh, by assuming f s v is equal to one. Okay, so what will be the c value? Okay, to be included in this equation. Okay. <clears throat> <clears throat> okay, the, 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 the output that we want to invent to, that we want to get is the C D value. Okay. So rearrange the equation or we can use the equations <clears throat> for this uh, the, the this one 5.19. Okay. So for the 5.19 equation. Okay, and then we already know that the height of the slope is two meter. So the other just uh, the other input is 19 for the unit weight over four. Okay. One minus cos beta is 90 because it is a vertical cut. Okay. Minus 28. 28 is the is the is the uh, fee value okay, based on uh, FS5 equal to one. So then over sine 90 cos 28, then we obtain 5.7 for the CD. Okay. So then we need to uh, get uh, the FSC okay, with C over CD. Okay. For this case, the C is 20.2 and the new CD is equal to 5.7. Okay. Then we get 3.54. Okay. Then we compare with the FSC. Okay, because in in this uh, in this first trial, we assume we put the FS fee is equal to one point zero. However, for the FSC, we obtain three point five four. Okay, <clears throat> so in that case, uh, we need to do for another uh, trial. Okay, so for the second trial, okay, the FS fee is equal to two point zero. Okay, then uh, determine the the fee value. Okay, that we use that we we use for uh, to input in uh, to include in the five point one nine okay uh, equation. So then we obtain fourteen point eight nine. Okay, so this this is not five point two zero. This is five point nine one nine. Okay, we using we use this equation. 5.919, not 5.20. This is 5.19. Okay. <clears throat> then uh, for the CD, we obtain 7.3. Okay. So the factor safety uh, for the FSC is equal to 2.77. Okay. So still not have a same value. Okay, then we do for another trial okay, uh, where we put the factor safety is equal to 3.0. Okay, then we obtain uh, 10.05 for the 5D. Okay, so uh, the same procedure we repeat to get the CD. Okay, then we obtain the FSC is equal to 2.54. Okay, so still not same. Okay. I guess uh, it is enough uh, to do a trial up to three attempts. Okay? So then we plot a graph okay, where the FSV okay, uh, is uh, on the X axis, while, so FSV is on the X axis and Y for the FSC on the Y axis. Okay? So this is the relation that is uh, that's been established okay, for the three point. Okay. So why we need to do at least three point? 
Okay, because uh, we want to determine either it is a linear or a non-linear relation. So, for example, if we only do two line, okay, so definitely we um, we obtain a linear or a straight line equation uh, relation. Okay, <clears throat> so that therefore, uh, if we do uh, up to three times, okay, so we know that. Uh, idea it is a non-linear or a linear. So uh, a minimum number of trial is three. Okay. So then we 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 obtain a non-linear relation. Okay. So the next is to uh, draw a line of equality. Okay. So with that, uh, FSC one, FS five one, FSC two, FS five two. FS3, FS53. Okay, so draw uh, this uh, line of equality. Okay, so the intersection between uh, the the relationship that we have produced okay, uh, with the line of equality is the value for the uh, factor safety. Okay, so for this case, the factor safety is equal to two point six. Okay, based on this. Um, approach okay so if you want to uh, repeat uh, the analysis okay so you put for example factor 2.6 okay and then try to solve it again and i guess the factor safety for the fsc will equal to 2.6 okay <clears throat> okay Okay, so that, that is for uh, Dr. Noli example. Eh? Okay. So now we look on DAS. Okay, so they, they call it as a cool man, uh, methods eh? uh, this uh, plane failure surface. So actually, Kuhlman also uh, pro, uh, has proposed uh, uh, an, uh, sorry, a method eh, to determine uh, the stability eh, to determine the stability of uh, of a retaining structure by using a graphical uh, methods. Okay. So this is the explanation. I guess similar with what that uh, we discussed in Dr. Nodi. Okay. Uh, okay. okay uh, this is the explanation uh, to determine the theta value uh, um, where the developed coefficient would be maximum. Okay. However, uh, yeah, because this is very a mathematical equation. Okay. So if if we want to if we want to get uh, the theta value, okay, by uh, by using yeah, if you want to prove the derivation, okay, so you need to follow from fifteen point two six, fifteen point two seven, and then you may obtain fifteen point two eight. Okay, I have tried to to. So to calculate for this one, okay, but I didn't get uh, the 15.28 uh, value. Okay, might be if you have time, okay. So try to prove uh, this uh, derivation, okay, based on the explanation from DAS, okay, to get the value for the theta CR. Okay, so uh, I will try to uh, get the answer later on. Might, uh, might be, I will ask somebody okay, uh, on how to get the value for the theta CR okay, uh, for uh, on our next class. Eh? Okay, then the same procedure. Uh, yeah, uh, to get the CD, okay, or if you want to get the critical height, so we may use the equation fifteen point three one. Okay. Okay, so uh, okay, 
Okay, this is an example based on uh, dust. Okay. So a cut is to be made in soil having, uh, so this is not a vertical cut. Eh? Okay. So this is a no, this is the uh, a, uh, a cut of slope with a certain, uh, not a beta equal to 90. Okay. So in this case, the beta uh, so uh, a cut is to be made in a soil having um, gamma. Okay, because this uh, books um, uh, a US book, okay, a reference book, so they use the 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 uh, the the unit in pound and feet. But some some of the some of the example they use kilo newton over meter square, okay, meter cube. Okay, so that is, this is for gamma, this is for c, but well, this is the for phi. Okay. The side of the cut slope will make an angle of 45 degree with the horizontal. Okay. What uh, should be the depth of the cut that will have a factor safety of 3? Okay. So, phi 15 C, uh, if FS is equal to 3, then FSC, uh, FSP, I guess the same from what uh, Dr. Nodigo, for example. Eh? Okay. So C over C D. Uh, C D is equal to 200. Okay. Then uh, 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 determine the factor safety uh, for the FS uh, for the FSP. Okay. Where uh, tangent 15 over 3. Okay. Okay. Okay, then the fee, uh, the fee D is equal to 5.1. Okay. So substituting the, uh, the proceeding value of C and T, okay, then uh, the H, we use the H to determine the height of the, of the slope. Okay. C D is, uh, in this case, is equal to 200. Okay, over gamma, which is 105. Sine beta times cos uh, one minus cos beta minus theta uh, three d. Okay, so we obtain twenty three point zero five. Okay. So that is the height that allowed to be constructed. Okay. Okay. okay, so that that is for example this on. Does similar with uh, the example number number one in Doctor Noli. Sorry, uh, sorry, number two actually number two. But for number two for Doctor Noli, uh, she is uh, use the vertical cut. Okay. So, and the last example for Doctor Kamarudin for this uh, vertical cut. Uh, sorry for the linear failure plane. Okay, a little bit different. Okay, however, um, uh, we determine the factor safety okay, uh, for this uh, linear failure plane methods. Okay, so he introduced what we call as a force polygon. Okay, uh, we discuss the example. Uh, uh, we explain a little bit and then discuss on the example. Eh? <clears throat> so the type of the failure occur when, okay, when a field or an embankment has weak plane or when there is excavation in layer soil and the layer direction is downward to the excavation okay, so this is what I've, dis uh, I've mentioned previously okay, when we have uh, 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 when we construct an embankment, the end there has a weak plane. Okay. 
or uh, for a natural slope. Okay, we do the excavation and then we find that uh, there are a layer direction is downward to the excavation. Okay. So force polygon may be utilized to analyze the slope stability. Okay. Both the example of the slope and force polygon are shown in figure 3.4. Okay. So this is the explanation on, on the notation. Okay. HW, I guess same. Okay, however, for the CR, CR is called cohesive soil along failure plane, uh, also similar. Okay, where we want to detect, where we want to determine what is the C, uh, the, 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 the cohesive soil. Okay, in this case, Dr. Kamarin used the capital of CR, okay, is equal to small letter of CR, which is the cohesion times L. Okay, so L is the length, E is the internal vision angle. Okay. So the first procedure, okay, assume a value of the FST, okay, and then calculate the phi, phi r or the phi r value okay, is equal to tangent, uh, a tangent, tangent uh, phi over factor safety. Okay. So the same uh, what we used previously, okay, where we uh, uh, we do this is for the try and error method. Okay. Okay. So this is the this is the the um, uh, the linear failure plane uh, diagram. Okay. While okay, this is for for the post polygon. Okay. So it means that uh, the direction of the CR. Okay. Uh, from here to this direction. Okay. So there will be a W, which is uh, moving downward. Okay, and there is a P, which is a, which is the uh, the normal stress acting on the failure plane. Okay. Um, uh, the reaction of the normal stress acting on the failure plane. Okay. So this is the degree for each uh, uh, for each uh, angle. Okay. So normally we only use CR and W. Okay, to solve the problem uh, because P is not uh, important, okay? but uh, we need to show that this loop are close okay? to show uh, to, to represent for the uh, post polygon. Okay. So then determine the CR using the post polygon. Okay. So we may use the, the equation, uh, sorry, the relations okay? uh, CR. Uh, over okay, uh, theta minus uh, phi r equal to w over 90 plus uh, phi r. So we use the sign law okay, to solve these problems. Okay. So then determine the factor safety fs uh, where c over cr. Okay. <clears throat> so the cr uh, to, to to get the CR, it actually is the smaller uh, capital CR over L. Okay. So then uh, we uh, we need to compare okay, the factor safety of the FSC okay, should equal with the factor safety FSC. So compare the factor safety of C obtained in the step part four with the assumed factor safety um, in the step of one. Okay. So if the factor safety is not equal, uh, so repeat the step okay, or until a curve of SC again FSP can be plotted. Okay. So the same procedure on Dr. Noldi Gopa example where we do a trial try and error methods. Okay. So the factor safety of the slope is when factor safety FSC is equal to factor safety V. Okay. So this is the procedure. Okay, then we, we uh, I will show uh, with you uh, the example. Eh? Okay. So normally an engineer uh, we need to see the number so easy for us to understand rather than we just go through that kind of notes okay 
So I will share later in the e-learning, okay, on this part. Then we go first for the example. Okay, so this this is an example. Eh? Okay, a little bit tricky here because uh, uh from Dr. Noli Goffa and Dr. Uh, from Das Reference Book, okay, there is no a sloping on the top of the slope. Okay, so it has a slope here, and then it has another slope on the top, which is ten degree. Okay, so uh, we need to determine what is the block. Uh, volume of this block okay okay so determine the flexibility of the slope in figure q36 using plane failure method okay the soil parameter are 18 c14 and t is equal to 30 <clears throat> okay um so the first job is to determine what is the uh the, the 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 volume of this block and then we may multiply with the 18 uh the unit weight and also the height okay. so first determine the dimension of the sliding which okay before calculating the the weight w okay. so the be be okay we can easily get from this uh equation which is 6 over sine 60. So we obtain 6.93 for the BE. Okay. Then uh, we need to determine what is the BD. Okay. So this BD uh, is equal to, okay, uh, because I, uh, yeah, I will try to Okay, we need to use the sign law, sign sign law, uh, to get the degree, eh? to get the degree, eh, to get the length of the BD. Okay, so for example, uh, sign K over uh, is equal to over A, which is the length of the A. Okay equal to sine p over the distance of the b and sine c <clears throat> over c okay. uh, uh, i need to draw to explain this one Okay, I guess uh, you still remember this uh, sign law. Okay, for example, if this is A, B, C, okay. So to get the distance of the AC, so we need to know what is the degree of this one. Okay, so we assume this is we we put as a ac okay. so uh sign ac over ac is the distance of the ac okay. is equal to okay for example for this case So this will be BC. And this will be AB. Okay. Equal to sign. Um, BC. Over. BC okay or uh, we can put here 
sine a b a b over a b so from there we can get the distance okay let's say uh, but we only use two uh, for example if you want to 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 solve any 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 value so we need to uh, use only two two uh, two relation only okay or if you want to use another relation okay, we use this sine over ab over ac equal to sine bc over bc but before that we need to determine the degree for each um, uh, point okay for example we need to know bc ac ab so the total is 180 of degree okay so that, that is for the sign a signs law <clears throat> okay Okay, so for this case, uh, we need to determine what 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 uh, is uh, the degree for each uh, uh, point. Okay? For example, this uh, will be 15. Okay? 16 minus 45, so this will be 15. Okay, so we need to get what is the degree of this uh, point and also this one. Uh, okay, so I, I could not draw on this. Uh, I will draw on 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 the pin. Let, let me draw on the pin first. Mm. Okay. okay. Okay, this is 45. Okay, and this is 60 or 15. Okay. So if we extend this one, then uh, the degree of the angle is 10, the degree of this slope on the top of the slope is 10, okay? So what is the degree of this uh, part? And what is the degree of this area? Okay, in the first calculation, we already know, uh, you, you can see my pin, my... Uh... Yes, problem. Yes. Okay. So uh, for the BE, okay, so, Six point nine three. Okay, so we have calculated the first one. This is six point nine three. Okay. <clears throat> so in order uh, to then we need to determine what is the degree of this one. Okay. So let's say if we draw a straight line as well. Okay. So based on the simple what we call it, based on the simple. Uh, degree eh? uh, this should be a uh, 45 eh? okay. 
this is going to be 45. Okay. So this is 45 because it, uh, yeah, when, when we have this kind of uh, parallel line, then we have a slope. So this area, this will be equal to uh, the other, uh, the other degree. Okay. So this is will be 45. Okay. And definitely this is 10. Okay. So from there we can get the value of this is equal to 35. Okay. So 15 plus, 15, uh, sorry, 15, 15 plus 35 is equal to 50. So definitely this will be 130. Okay. Because the whole of the degree for the triangle is 180. Okay. So to get the length of this one, for example, this is B. 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 Okay. So to, to get the, the length of the B, D. So this 130 sine 130 over BD okay, is equal to, so we already know the, the, the length of the BE, so it's better for us to use the BE. Okay. BE is 6.93. Okay. And this is sine. 35. Okay. So from there, we can get the value of the ED. Okay. Sine 35 over 6.93. Okay. So sine 130 divide with the answer of sine 35 over 6.93. So we obtain 9 point. Two five nine point two six. Okay, nine point two six for this length of BD. Okay, nine point two six or nine point two five. Okay. 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 So that is the length of the BD. Nine point two five. Okay. So then uh, we determine the width of the width of the width, okay, where gamma okay, where gamma is gamma is the is the unit width. Okay. Uh, however, for the area of this width, okay, if it, it is not a typical uh, triangular where we use the half okay, times b over l. So we need to use the, the, this equation okay, where the BD is B, this is the BD the, the L okay, times BE sine uh, 15 okay. so this is the, 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 the how to determine the area okay. so you can you can try to try to uh, get the formula or, uh, by looking at by or uh, by searching for uh, a non irregular uh, or a irregular shape of triangle. Okay. Then we obtain one for nine. Okay, so that is for the W. Okay. <clears throat> cool. uh, then we use a try and error okay, where we use the FFC equal to one. Okay. Uh, to get the 30, okay, and uh, yeah, then we get 30 because uh, tangent 30 over 1, okay, so based on the force polygon, okay, okay, either we want to use the force polygon or we can use, uh, we can use what, uh, the RS, eh, this one, okay. we, 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 uh, our, our, we, try, we, we, we may try later, eh? is it possible to use this RS over T? Okay. So based on the post polygon, okay, 
So W, the same, the, 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 we use the same sign law, okay, W over sine 90, okay, this is the force polygon, okay, we use the W, okay, over sine uh, 90 plus pi R, okay, uh, equal to CR over theta minus pi R. Because we 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 determine the phi r okay, based on the velocity equal to one, so the phi r is equal to thirty. Okay, now we want to find what is the cr. Eh? Okay, then we obtain the cr, which is forty four point eight. Okay. This is the capital cr. Okay. The one that we want to determine is the small letter of cr. Okay, so the cr over l is equal to four point eight. Okay. Then we continue by using the factor safety of C, okay, to get what is the factor safety of C by uh, divide the C over CR, 14 over 4.8, then we obtain 2.9. So FSC is not equal to FF5. Then we continue uh, for the second prior. FSV is equal to 2, okay. then uh, the phi r is equal to 16.1. Okay. So we use the same um, of force polygon. Okay. Then we get 75.1 for the capital CR. So then the small letter of CR is equal to 8.1. Okay. The FSC is equal to 1.73, still not same. <clears throat> then we repeat again for the second last trial. Okay? FSC is equal to three. Okay? So we use the phi r equal to ten point nine. Then okay? later on the CR capital CR eighteen point two. Small letter CR is equal to nine point two. So then we obtain one point five two. So still not same. Okay? Then uh, Dr. Kamaruddin okay, list up to four trial, okay, which is the 1.5 is not been included in the example. So he obtained 2.0. Okay, the same approach with what we have discussed in Dr. Noli. So we obtain, uh, we draw the, 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 the relationship okay, and then draw the line of equality then we obtain 1.8 okay, for the factor safety. Okay. So that is for the uh, another approach by using the post polygon. Okay. Okay. So I, I, will, I will share this uh, example in the learning um, right after the class. Eh? Okay. So we take a break for 10 minutes and then we, we may continue. Uh, for another example on the total stress methods. Okay. Okay. So we take, uh, we have a break. Eh? I will give the attendant a link uh, right after the class. Eh? Okay. So take a break first. If you want to have your breakfast. So I guess 10 minutes is enough. Okay. Okay.